Hello viewer, welcome to my YouTube channel Software Testing. For software testing purpose, first thing you need to do write your software testing test case. As you know, for writing software testing test case, it's a manual effort. Now there are multiple AI in the market like ChatGPT, Google Gemini, um, Bing Copilot, and also DeepSeek recently launched. Today I'll show you how you can write your test case automatically using AI. Today I will use ChatGPT and Deep6. Then you will take your decision which AI you will use for your writing software testing test case. So let's open any browser. Within the browser, you need to go chatgpt.com and DeepSeek also deepseek.com. So basically, you need to create your account first. Thereafter, you will be able to use those AI. So here is my AI prompt I already defined. Can you please write software testing test case for an application login functionality in Excel format? I will use the same prompt for both AI. Let's see how it goes, how they write the test cases for login functionality. Click over here, it will it is a start writing. At the same time, I'll use same prompt in DeepSeek, then hit enter. Also, you can click over here then DeepSeek will start writing your test case after analyzing your question. Let's see how it goes and how the uh, test case look like as it is real life or not. So here already uh, our chat GPT written test case, it has 10 test cases and also some note. Let me take only the test case, whatever written in Excel format, thereafter I will um, verify both test cases and thereafter audience, you will take the decision which AI you will use for your writing software testing test case. Copy from here. Let's go to the Excel file. Here, chat GPT. Let me paste it over here. Here, it has been written. Let me see if, what about the deep seek. Deep seek till it is writing. Also, it has been written the almost same thing. 10 test cases. Let's see how it goes. Let me copy from here all the test cases up to this, then copy and go to the Excel file. I'll paste it in the next sheet. Here is deep seek, control V. So here, let me do one by one. DeepSeek also written 10 test cases for login functionality. Here is the header, test case ID, test case description, precondition, test step, test data, expected result, then actual result, then here is the status, pass, fail, thereafter comments. Whatever the header row, it is exactly correct in real life, whatever we do for testing purpose, it has been written all of those. Let's say, First test case, verify successful login with valid credential. Exactly, we do the same thing with valid credential, invalid username, invalid password, all the step it has been written. Looks like it is similar um, like whatever we do in real life. So let's see, verify the chat GPT. Chat GPT, test case ID, test scenario. Chat GPT did not return the precondition. It is okay, a precondition, it is not required all the time for testing purpose. Test step, test data, expected result, actual result, and pass fail status, then remarks as may, I mean comments as uh, DeepSeek stated. It has also written 10 test cases, and also valid login, invalid login, um, with wrong password, wrong username, all the functionality, whatever needed for login functionality, both has covered all. Now, audience, it is your decision which AI you will use for writing software test cases. It is both AI, so for my understanding, it has been written exactly similar whatever we do in real life. So this is the way you can create your prompt and you can write insert your prompt in the chat box. Thereafter hit enter and AI automatically will write your test cases based on your application, based on your scenario, you can modify and thereafter you can do whatever you need to do. Basically those type of test case 
writing manually it takes some time the, if you use ai you can save your lot of time for writing test case i believe this will be helpful for those who are new in software testing as well as software testing test case writing if you think this is helpful please like my video subscribe my channel and share it to others also if you have any question please make a comment i'll get back to you as soon as possible thank you for watching this video